Hello friends and my dear students this is your Yoganandam Biology Lecturer from Edel Academy YouTube channel here we are going to discuss one biology full syllabus test paper with detailed solutions as per new pattern let us continue one by one. Question number one. Select the incorrect match from the following. The tiger, zoological name is Panthera tigris is a member of the family Felidae, Canis, Ursus etc. belongs to the family Canidae. Families Felidae and Canidae falls under the order Carnivora, Solanum, Petunia and Datura belongs to the family Solanaceae. Families Convolulaceae and Solanaceae come under the order Polymonials. So the incorrectly matched one is option D. Question number 2. Under favorable conditions, somatic cells store food material which become thick walled structure and are called as under favorable conditions somatic cells store food materials which become thick walled called echinites they germinate to form new filaments and colony so the answer for this question is option b echinites question number three the thalloid body of slime mold is known as Slime molds are saprophytic protists. Under suitable conditions, they form an aggregation called plasmodium, which may grow and spread up to several feet. So the answer for this question is option D, plasmodium. Question number four: Which one of the following organism is not an example of unicellular eukaryote? Euglena, Goniolax, and Amoeba are all unicellular eukaryotes. E. coli is unicellular prokaryotic bacterial cell. So the answer for this question is option D. E. coli bacterium. Question number 5. In which group of plant kingdom gametophyte is dependent on sporophyte? In gymnosperm, main plant body is diploid sporophyte because of the plant body is differentiated into roots, stem and leaves which produces small gametophyte which is not free living and independent structure and it is dependent on sporophyte for development and nutrition. Male gametophyte is pollen grain which is liberated after its germination and female gametophyte is endosperm which remain on the sporophyte before and after fertilization. So the answer for this question is option D. Gymnosperm. Question number 6. Which of these plant is correctly matched with its reproductive characteristics? Here there are four sentences are given. Go through the sentences carefully. Sphagnum is a bryophyte. In bryophytes, a male sex organ is called as anthridium, produce biflagellate anthrozoids, while the female sex organ called as archegonium produces a single egg. Sequoia is a gymnosperm. In gymnosperm, one of the megaspore enclosed within the megasporangium develops into multicellular female gametophyte that bears two or more archegonia or female sex organs. Wolfia is an angiosperm. It is an example for smallest flowering plant. Angiosperm showed double fertilization in which one of the male gamete fuses with the egg to form zygote while the other male gamete fuses with the diploid secondary nucleus to produce the triploid primary endosperm nucleus. Polysyponia is a red algae belongs to the family Rhodopisae. In Rhodopites sexual reproduction is hugamous with non-motile gametes and accompanied by complex post fertilization developments. So the answer for this question is option D. From the given four statements, all the four statements are correctly given. Question number seven. Which one of the following statement is correct? Tulips are most popular and widely grown flowers. Tulips are bulbs possessing modified stems and leaves. So the answer for this question is option D. The flower of tulip is a modified shoot that is the Correct statement. Question number 8. 
Which of these properties are seen in hibiscus rosa sinensis? It is commonly called as China rose. Here there are uh, four sentences are given. Hibiscus rosa sinensis, commonly called as China rose, has axial placentation. It has polycarpillary, syncarpus superior ovary with the hypogynous flower. It has an alternate type of pilotaxy in which a single leaf arises at each node in an alternate manner. It has twisted estivation in which one of the margin of the petal overlaps that of the next one and so on. So the answer for this question is option C. From the given four statements, first and third is correctly given. Question number 9. Two chief functions of leaves are. So you all know leaves generally carry out photosynthesis and transpiration. Photosynthesis and transpiration both are equally essential process because photosynthesis helps to maintain the equilibrium position of oxygen and carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and transpiration maintains the atmospheric temperature. So the answer for this question is option B. Photosynthesis and transpiration. Question number 10. Identify the correct statement with respect to secondary growth in dicot roots. In dicot roots, the vascular cambium is completely secondary in origin and it originates from the portion of a pericycle tissue. The pericycle is a cylinder of parenchyma or a sclenchyma cells that lies just inside the endodermis. Corcambium or pelogen originates from the outer layer of cortex, epidermis and also from pericycle. It gives rise to pellum or cork on the outer side and a pelodum or a secondary cortex on the inner side. So the answer for this question is option C. So from the given four statements, correctly given A and C about dicot roots. Question number 11. Ribosomes are the particular about 200 Armstrong units in diameter consisting of protein and RNA. The percentage of protein and RNA in eukaryote is Chemically, ribosomes are made up of ribosomal RNA 60% and protein 40%. These are known as protein factories as these are the sites for protein synthesis. So the answer for this question is Option D 40% and 60% Question number 12 which one of the following does not differ in E. coli and Chlamydomonas? Although E. coli is a prokaryotic cell with a peptidoglycan cell wall and Chlamydomonas is eukaryotic with a cellulosic cell wall but they have cell membrane as a common structure which is essentially the same and it is made up of phospholipid bilayer. Other components as mentioned above namely ribosomes, cell wall, nuclear organization differ in these organisms. So the answer for this question is option C. Cell membrane does not differ in E. coli and chlamydomonas. Question number 13. A small aquatic plant was put in each of the petri dishes X and Y containing different culture solutions. After 6 weeks, the plant in a uh, the eggs had the same number of leaves as earlier and all leaves were small and yellowish. The plant in dish Y had more leaves of normal size and dark green color. Which one of the following set of elements would be missing in the culture of dish X? The types of deficiency symptoms shown in plants include chlorosis, necrosis, stunted plant growth, premature fall of leaves and buds and the inhibition of cell division. Chlorosis is the loss of chlorophyll leading to yellowing in leaves. This symptom is caused by the deficiency of elements such as nitrogen, potassium, magnesium, sulfur, ferrous, manganese, zinc and molybdenum. So the answer for this question is option A. Magnesium, potassium and nitrogen. Question number 14. The translocation of organic solutes in the CO tube member is supported by 
the accepted mechanism used for the translocation of sugar from source of sink is called as pressure flow hypothesis the movement of sugar in the phloem begins at the source where the sugars are loaded that means actively transported into the sieve tube loading of phloem sets of water potential gradient that facilitates the mass movement in the phloem the answer for this question is option c mass flow involving a carrier Question number 15 Three PGA is first stable product in Three phosphoglyceric acid is the first stable product of Calvin Benson cycle or C3 cycle or carbon reduction cycle In this carbon dioxide is utilized for the carboxylation of RUBP This reaction is catalyzed by the enzyme Rubisco and it results in the formation of two molecules of 3 PGA so the answer for this question is option A carbon reduction cycle question number 16 during photo respiration the decarboxylation reaction occurs in in mitochondria glycine that means two molecules of glycine together form serine one molecule and carbon dioxide so the answer for this question is option b mitochondria question number 17 the conversion of glucose to glucose 6 phosphate is catalyzed by during the process of glycolysis glucose and fructose are phosphorylated to give rise to glucose 6 phosphate by the activity of the enzyme exokinase so the answer is option c exokinase question number 18 treatment of seeds at low temperature under moist conditions to break its dormancy is called stratification involves the treatment of seed at low temperature 5 to 10 degree celsius under sufficiently moist conditions to break its dormancy and to induce germination so the answer is option a stratification question number 19 cytokinins were discovered as kinetin it is a modified form of adenine a purine it is obtained from the autoclaved herring sperm dna kinetin does not occur naturally in plants search for natural substances with cytokinin like activities lead to the isolation of zeatin from corn kernel and coconut milk since the discovery of zeatin several naturally occurring cytokinins and some synthetic compounds with cell division promoting activity have been identified so the answer for this question is option d kinetin cytokinins were discovered as kinetin question number 20 flocks which are used in the secondary treatment of sewage are Flocks are aerobic masses of bacteria associated with fungal filaments forming maze-like structures. These microbes consume the major part of the organic matter in the effluent reducing its biological oxygen demand. So the answer for this question is option D. Masses of bacteria associated with fungal filaments forming maze-like structures are called as flocks. Question number 21 Which one of the following processes result in the formation of a clone of bacteria Binary fission that means division in half is a type of asexual reproduction it is the most common form of reproduction in prokaryotes such as bacteria it occurs in some single celled eukaryotes like amoeba and the paramecium in binary fission dna replication and segregation occur simultaneously the daughter cells formed as an exact copy of parental dna and they are clones of it so the answer is option b binary fission question number 22 basal part of ovule which lies opposite to micropyle is the ovule is integumented megasporangium which is protected by one or more envelope called as integuments 
integuments encircles the ovules except at micropyle opposite the micropylar end is the sulza representing the basal part of the ovule so the answer is option c sulza question number 23 there are 10 flowers in one individual plant of crotaleria in each microsporangium of every stamen of all the flowers there are 30 microspore mother cells how many pollen grains are formed from the plant the answer is 48000 because every flower of crotaleria would have 10 stamens 10 stamens would have 10 anthers 10 anthers would have 40 microsporangia each microsporangia has 30 microspore mother cells so 40 microsporangia would have 1200 microspore mother cells each microspore would produce four pollen grains taking the number of pollen grains produced by the flower 48000 so the answer for this question is option d 48000 question number 24 apomictic embryos in citrus arise from apomixis is abnormal kind of sexual reproduction in which egg or other cells associated with egg synergets antipodals etc develop into embryo without fertilization and meiosis development of embryo directly form saprophytic tissues like new cells and integuments is called as adventive embryo that mean adventive embryony which is also a type of apomixis example citrus and mango so the answer is option d maternal sporophytic tissue in ovule question number 25 in down syndrome karyotyping has shown that the disorder associated with trisomy of chromosome number 21 is usually due to down syndrome caused by trisomy 21 arises due to an occasional non disjunction during meiosis when a gamete possesses an extra chromosome that means n plus 1 fusion with a normal gamete produces trisomy so the answer for this question is option c non disjunction during formation of egg cells or sperm cells question number 26 in garden pea plant starch synthesis is regulated by capital b and small b alleles capital b and small b genotype producers a single gene product may be produce more than one effect for example starch synthesis in pea seed is controlled by one gene it has two alleles capital b and small b starch is synthesized effectively by capital b capital b homozygotes and therefore large starch grains are produced in contrast small b small b homozygotes have lesser efficiency in starch synthesis and produce smaller starch grains after maturation of seeds capital b capital b crossed with small b small b in the first filial generation the offspring is capital b and small b seeds are formed that means intermediate sized seeds were formed these intermediate sized seeds starch grain size is considered as the phenotype then form this angle the allele so incomplete dominance the starch grains producers are intermediate size capital b and small b seeds so the answer for this question is option c intermediate size round seeds question number 27 which of the following statement is true for color blindness color blindness is x linked recessive genetic disorder in which due to recessive allele present on x chromosome pigments are not synthesized by cone cells of high the the person is unable to distinguish between the primary color red and green it occurs more in males than in females and a carrier female can transfer the defective alleles of 50% of its son so the answer is option c is son of the carrier woman has 50% chances of being color blind question number 28 observe the four crosses given below in which the following crosses one is to one 
1 is to 1 ratio that means 1 is to 1 is to 1 is to 1 ratio of progenies is obtained 1 is to 1 is to 1 is to 1 is hybrid test cross that is dihybrid test cross phenotypic ratio it is obtained when crossing is done between hybrid and a recessive genotype when two gene locus is considered simultaneously so the answer is option C B and D crosses only gives the ratio of 1 is to 1 is to 1 is to 1 question number 29 which of the following mRNA will get translated completely the mRNA is a transcribed polynucleotide which is later translated by ribosome using tRNA to join amino acids and make protein. mRNA contains the genetic code which is a set of instructions that helps cells to obtain the information in making proteins from the DNA. The work of Corona and Nirenberg helped decipher the genetic code which is followed by all organisms in protein synthesis. The codes are always in triplets that is commonly called as codon from the sequence of 3N bases that is nitrogen bases and they are universal. AUG triplet is the initiator codon whose presence is must at the start of the sequence to initiate the translation process. So the answer for this question is option C because of the translated sequence is given correctly with start codon and a stop codon. Question number 30. The distance covered by a complete turn of DNA double helix is the DNA double helix can form somewhat different three dimensional Confirmations depending on environmental conditions and to some extent on the base sequence. Inside the cell, there are DNA is fully hydrated, a highly regular structure known as B form is adopted. The diameter of B DNA is 20 angstrom and the distance between base pass 3.4 angstrom. Since each helix has 10 base pair, the length is approximately 34 angstrom. So the answer for this question is option B. Question number 31. The sexual stages of malarial parasite is seen in. The malarial parasite requires two hosts, the human and the mosquitoes to complete its life cycle. The female anaplas mosquito is vector or transmitting agent during life cycle of plasmodium. Plasmodium enters the human body as a sporozoite that means infectious form through the bite of infected female anaphylus mosquito. The parasites initially multiply within the liver cells and then attack the red blood cells resulting in the rupture. The rupture of RBC is associated with the release of toxic substance hemozoin which is uh, responsible for the chill and high fever recurring every three to four days so the answer for this question is option c rbc a sexual stage of malarial parasite is seen in rbc question number 32 toddy is produced by toddy is also called palm wine is a traditional drink in south india is made by fermenting saffron palms so the answer is option B. Toddy is produced by the fermentation of sap from palms. Question number 33. Select the correct relationship from the following. Net primary productivity is commonly called as NPP. The amount is obtained when the respiration amount is removed from GPP. Hence NPP equal to GPP subtracted by the energy respiration therefore GPP equal to NPP plus respiration so the answer is option B question number 34 
the process of degradation of humus and release of inorganic nutrients by microbes is called humus is a dark colored substance resistant to microbial action when it is degrades inorganic nutrients are released this is called mineralization so the answer is option c mineralization question number 35 the main edible part of coconut fruit is coconut is a type of dwarf fruit in dwarf the fibrous part is mesocarp and the stony part is endocarp the edible part of the coconut is a seed or endosperm the answer is option a endosperm from section a we have discussed 35 questions in order from section b we are going to discuss 15 questions let us discuss one by one from section b first question morels and agaricus have edible fruiting bodies and belong to the respective class as marcella the true morels is a genus of edible sac fungi closely related to anatomically simpler cup fungi belongs to ascomycetes agaricus is an edible fungus and is commonly known as mushroom it is a saprophytic fungus found growing on soil humus decaying litter on forest floors in the fields and lawns wood logs and manure piles agaricus belongs to basidiomycetes so the answer for this question is option a ascomycetes and basidiomycetes morels and agaricus are the edible fruiting bodies belong to the class ascomycetes and basidiomycetes question number 2 oogamous type of sexual reproduction is found in oogamy is form of anisogamy it is service called as heterogamy in which the female gamete that is egg cell is significantly larger than the male gamete and is non motile oogamy is the most advanced form of reproduction with the egg cell or oogonium retained and fertilized on the parental plant so the answer is option b oogamous type of sexual reproduction found in volvox question number 3 the placentation is uh, carnation flower is correctly displayed by which one of the below diagram here there are four diagrams are given see the diagrammatic representation the arrangement of ovules within the ovary is known as placentation the placentation are of different types namely marginal axial placentation parietal placentation basal placentation free central placentation like that it has classified into different types when the placenta is axial and ovules are attached to it in the multilocular ovary the placentation is said to be axial placentation that is given in the figure a as in china rose tomato and lemon when the ovules are born on central axis and septa are absent as in dianthus that is otherwise called as carnation and prime rose the placentation is called as free central placentation so the second option is correctly given dianthus is otherwise called as carnation so in dianthus free central placentation is present you all know the c is marginal placentation d is parietal placentation question number 4 the stem with bicolateral vascular bundles and flowers with cyanandrous condition is found in in bicolateral vascular bundle xylem is surrounded on both sides by phloem in cyanandrous stamens both anther lobes and filaments are fused these conditions are characteristics of cucurbitaceae family so the answer is option c question number 5 match the following see the column 1 and column 2 the column 1 centriole is given so you are all know centriole is a basal body or a basal body of cilia or flagella so a is matching with a's chlorophyll 
chlorophyll is present in thylakoid so b is matching with q crista crista is found in the infoldings of mitochondria so c is matching with p ribozyme it is matching with r ribozyme is a kind of nucleic acid so the correctly matching option is a question number 6 during which stage in the complete oxidation of glucose is the greatest number of atp molecules produced from adp the total nadh entering in the electron transport system is 10 from glycolysis 2 nadh from linked reactions 6 nadh from krebs cycle ATP formed from 1 NADH is 3 thus ATP formed from 10 NADH is 30 total FADH2 entering in the electron transport system is 2 that is formed from krebs cycle ATP formed from 1 FADH2 is 2 thus ATP formed from 2 FADH2 is totally 4 thus the ATP formed in electron transport system is 34 out of the total 38 produced by complete aerobic respiration of one molecule of glucose so the answer is option d electron transport system question number 7 identify the characters with reference to the plant in which eight nucleated embryo sac was first studied by strasburger Strasburger in the year of 1879 first time described polygonum type of embryo sac on polygonum divericum orthotopus ovule is found in polygonum it is the simplest and primitive type in which micropyle salaza and funicle lie in one vertical plan monosporic embryo sac only one megaspore nucleus forms embryo sac example polygonum enothera so the answer for this question is option c from the given four statements see the statements totally there are four statements are given characters with reference to the plant in which eight nucleated embryo sac was first studied by strasburger from the four statements first and second is correctly given Question number eight: Holonic traits are gene located on Y chromosome is called as holonic gene, and the traits are called holonic traits, and they are transferred only to all male progeny. So the answer is option A: Y chromosome linked traits. Question number nine: Splicing means. Splicing is the process in which HN RNA undergoes processing to form functional mRNA. HN RNA consists of functional or active segment called exon and non-functional or inactive segment called intron. You know, coding region is called as exon. Non-coding region is called as intron. In splicing, introns are cut and removed. and only the functional exons are joined to form functional mrna so the answer is option a splicing means removal of introns question number 10 the primate given below can be observed in types of ecological primates try to remember pyramid of number pyramid of biomass pyramid of energy generally the pyramid of number usually appear upright manner pyramid of biomass appear upright manner pyramid of energy always appear in upright manner in pyramid of number single tree ecosystem single tree many insects less number of small birds very few large birds that is exceptions pyramid of biomass pyramid of biomass in sea biomass of fishes in more than phytoplanktons that also exceptions 
pyramid of energy there are no exceptions so the answer for this question is option b pyramid of energy without any exceptions question number 11 rubisco enzyme can act both as carboxylase and as oxygenase in c4 cycle it functions as in c4 plants photo respiration does not occur this is because they have mechanism that increases the concentration of carbon dioxide at the enzyme site this uh, takes place when the c4 acid from the mesophyll is broken down in the bundle sheet cells to release carbon dioxide this results increasing the intracellular concentration of carbon dioxide in turn this ensures that the rubisco functions as carboxylase minimizing the oxygenase activity so the answer for this question is option c mainly carboxylase activity minimizing oxygenase question number 12 lysigenous activity in monocot stem vascular bundles developed by the dissolution of there are four types of systems present in monocot stems dermal tissue system hypodermal tissue system ground tissue system and vascular bundle tissue system there are barrel shaped parenchymata cells found in the epidermis trichomes are absent in the monocot stem and below the epidermis there is a layer of hypodermal cells present the ground tissue is undifferentiated in monocot stem which is made up of loosely arranged parenchymata cells there is a vascular bundle which is found scattered in the ground tissue xylem is found on the inner side whereas phloem on the outer side and cambium is absent in monocot stem so the inner protoxylem is non functional and remains water filled this water filled cavity is called as lysigenous cavity or protoxylem cavity or protoxylem lacuna so the answer is option a protoxylem question number 13 select the incorrect statement about liliaceae family liliaceae is the monocot family in which root is fibrous and uh, leaves shows parallel venation flower is bisexual and actinomorphic sepals and petals are not distinct and are completely fused as tepals which is generally shows valvate aspiration so the answer is option a the incorrect statements are bisexual zygomorphic flowers are given question number 14 match the following and choose the correct options from the below see the column 1 and column 2 meristem is matching with actively dividing cells because of you all know meristematic cells are present at the tip of the root system and the shoot system it undergoes active cell division so a is matching with 3 b is matching with 1 parenchymata cells carry out photosynthesis and storage parenchymata cells with chlorophyll carry out the process photosynthesis and mainly mainly carry out the process storage so b is matching with 1 colon chyma colon chymata cells provide mechanical support so it is matching with 2 scleran chyma Sclerenchymata cells are broadly divided into sclerites and fibers. Sclerites are otherwise called as stone cells. So sclerenchyma is matching with sclerites. Epidermal tissue. Epidermal tissues of leaves contain stomata. So it is matching with four. So the correctly matching option is option B. Question number fifteen. Rapid internodal elongation is caused due to which hormone? Gibberellin promotes rapid internodal elongation in genetically dwarf plants. So this phenomena is known as bolting. It is also causes internodal elongation in plants like uh, sugar cane. Thus, it is used to increase productivity of sugar cane. So the answer is option A. let us continue from zoology first we are going to discuss from section a 35 questions 
क्वेश्चन नंबर वन विच ऑफ दी फॉलोइंग इज यूज इन डी एन ए फिंगर प्रिंटिंग डी एन ए फिंगर प्रिंटिंग यूज सिंगल स्टैंडर्ड रेडियो एक्टिव प्रो दट आर वाश ओवर दि नईलॉन् सर्फेस टू अलो दर जॉयिंग टू एनी डी एन ए फ्रेगमेंट आफ सेम कांपोजिशन दर् बै मैचिंग डिफ्रेंट डी एन ए सैंपल डबल स्टैंडर्ड प्रो वुड नाट हईब्रिड वित् डी एन ए फ्रेगमेंट प्रेसेंट आन दि नईलॉन् मेम्रेन सो द आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी प्रो क्वेश्चन नंबर टू Which of these pairs of organisms are bilaterally symmetrical and triploblastic? The members of phyla Ascheelminthes and Platyelminthes are triploblastic and bilaterally symmetrical. Ascaris is a round worm, while Planaria is a freshwater flat worm. So the answer is option A. Ascaris and Planaria. Question number three. An asexual structure is shown in the given diagram. In which of the following organism the given structure is found? Asexual reproductive structures like zoospores, conidia, buds, gemmules are found in different types of organisms. Zoospores, example, members of kingdom fungi and simple plants like algae, Chlamydomonas. Conidia, commonly seen in Penicillium. Buds, Hydra. Gemmules are seen in sponges. So the given diagrammatic representation is gemmule, found in sponges. Question number four: The supporting cells of nerve tissue is neurons and glial cells make the neural system. Neurons are specialized cells that are responsible for transmission of signals. Neural glial cells support neurons. Neurons are main conducting cells but occupy less than one of the volume, while supporting cells occupy more than half of the volume. These cells do not show conduction but can regenerate. Oligodendrocytes, Schwann cells, microglial cells are its examples. These cells protect neurons by phagocytosis. So the answer for this question is option B. The supporting cells of nerve tissue is neuroglia. Question number five. Choose the correct statements from the fo given following statements. Cockroach belong to phylum Arthropoda. The body is divided into head, thorax, and abdomen. Head is made up of six segments, and it is freely movable in all directions. Thorax is made up of three parts: prothorax, mesothorax, and metathorax. The abdomen is made up of ten segments in both male and female. So the answer is option D. Abdomen of both males and female cockroach is made up of ten segments. That is the correct statement. Question number six: The given figure shows three velocity substrate concentration curves for an enzyme reaction. What do the curve x, y, and z depict respectively? So, in the given diagrammatic representation, enzymes are biocatalysts or proteinaceous substances that are capable of catalyzing chemical reactions of biological system without themselves undergoing any change. The graph x shows normal enzyme reaction, y shows competitive inhibition. And is that source non-competitive inhibition? So the answer for this question is option A. The given diagrammatic representation: X source normal enzyme reaction, Y source competitive inhibition, Z source non-competitive inhibition. Question number seven: Which of the following statement regarding enzyme inhibition is correct? Here there are four statements are given: inhibition of an enzyme. can be competitive or non competitive competitive inhibition is seen when the substrate and the inhibitor compete for the same active site on the enzyme as their structures are similar an example of competitive inhibition was demonstrated experimentally for the enzyme succinic dehydrogenase which catalyzes the oxidation of succinate to fumarate in the krebs cycle so the answer for this question is option c Competitive inhibition is seen when the substrate and the inhibitor compete for an active site. Question number eight: The diagram below shows the cell cycle. Which of the following process occur during V? See the diagrammatic representation. In the given diagram, V labeled phase in the G1 phase. G1 phase marks the start of interphase. G1 phase is the metabolically active phase, and during this phase, the cell grows in size. Synthesis of mRNA and the protein of DNA synthesis occur. So the answer for this question is option D. High metabolic rate and synthesis of protein and cellular organelles takes place in the represented V. 
Question number 9. The enzyme salivary amylase breaks down starch into maltose at pH of. A saliva secreted into the oral cavity contains electrolytes and enzymes such as salivary amylase and lysozyme. The chemical process of digestion is initiated in the oral cavity by the hydrolytic action of the carbohydrate splitting enzyme. The salivary amylase approximately 30% of starch is utilized here by the enzyme. So the answer for this question is option B 6.8. Question number 10. An oval mass of white matter present above the medulla oblongata act as an oval mass of white matter present above the medulla oblongata act as pneumotoxic center. Pons veroli is situated in front of the cerebellum, below the midbrain and above the medulla oblongata. It relates impulses between the medulla oblongata and the most superior part of the brain, between the hemispheres of the cerebellum and between the cerebrum and the cerebellum. It contains centers that work with those in the medulla to regulate breathing. So the answer is option D, pneumotaxic center. Question number 11, the blood pressure values of 4 persons are given below. See the given blood pressure value. Who among the following has normal blood pressure? So you all know the difference between hypertension and hypotension. Hypertension term for blood pressure that is higher than normal. The normal blood pressure is 120 by 80. In this measurement 120 systolic value or pumping pressure and 80 mm is the diastolic value or resting pressure. If repeated checks of blood pressure of an individual 140 by 90 means 140 denoted as systolic 90 diastolic or higher it shows hypertension. High blood pressure lead to heart diseases and also affects vital organs like brain and kidney. So the answer for this question is option A. Mr. A is having normal blood pressure 120 by 80, 120 systolic, 80 diastolic. Question number 12. Read the following statements. From the given four statements, how many statements are correct? Go through the statements. Limp is blood white, that is, you know, limp is blood without RBC. Plasma without the clotting factor is called as serum. The universal donor is O negative because it does not have Rh antigen which is present in an O positive individual. The Rh antigen can induce an immune response hence O negative not O positive. O negative is a universal donor. So the answer for this question is option C. From the given four statements only two statements are correctly given. Question number 13. Which one of the following statement is correct with respect to kidney function regulation? Antidiuretic hormone or vasopressin is secreted from neurohypophysis or the posterior pituitary. ADH stimulates reabsorption of water from last part of distal convoluted tubule and entire collecting duct by increasing the permeability of cells. This leads to reduction in urine volume and decrease in osmolarity of blood. The answer for this question is option B. When someone drinks lot of water, ADH releases is suppressed is given. So that statement is correct with respect to kidney function regulation. Question number 14. How many of the following animals are ureotelic? Here some animal names are given. Shark, human, skate and frog are ureotelic. Types of animals on the basis of excretive waste, aminotelic examples, many bony fishes, aquatic amphibians, aquatic insects, ureotelic, marine fishes, many terrestrial amphibians and mammals, uricotelic, insects, land snails, reptiles and birds. So the answer for this question is option C. There are four animals are ureotelic. Question number 15. Which of the following statement is correct about skeletal muscle? Skeletal muscles have thin elongated cells with blend cells. They are derived from mesoderm and are under voluntary control. Faint, seriations and intercalated discs are seen in cardiac muscles. Thin elongated cells with tapering ends are seen in smooth muscles. So the answer is option C. 
they are derived from mesoderm and are voluntary in action that is uh, correct about uh, skeletal muscle question number 16 with reference to different structures of the human brain, which one is an incorrect match? Medulla oblongata of uh, hand brain is containing centers which control respiration, cardiovascular reflexes, gastric secretion, and vomiting. Hypothalamus of fire brain contains a number of centers which control body temperature, urge for eating and drinking. So the answer is option C. Medulla oblongata controls respiration, cardiovascular reflexes, excitement, and the urge for eating and drinking is given. That is the incorrect match. Question number 17. Adrenaline and noradrenaline are hormones that epinephrine is always called as adrenaline and norepinephrine is always called as noradrenaline act as both neurotransmitters and hormones in the body. They both play important role in the body's fight or flight response and when they are released into the bloodstream, they cause an increase in the blood pressure, heart rate and blood sugar level. So the answer is option D about adrenaline and noradrenaline hormones. All the three statements are correctly given. Question number 18. Select the incorrect match. Here, past distal is the service called as anterior pituitary. In the anterior pituitary growth hormone, adrenocorticotropic hormone, euthanizing hormone, follicle stimulating hormones are secreted. The past intermedia secrete melanocyte stimulating hormone. Here, the incorrect match is vasopressin. Vasopressin is service called as anti vasopressin is secreted in the posterior pituitary. But you are given anterior pituitary. That is incorrect match. Question number 19. Read the following statement. From the given statements, how many of the statements are incorrect? Isthmus in thyroid is the thin flap of connective tissue. A is incorrectly given. C. Source of growth hormone and prolactin is same. So that also incorrectly given. So, from the given four statements, A and C is incorrectly given. So, the answer is option C. Two statements are incorrectly given. Question number 20. Select the parts of the female reproductive system that is homologous to the penis of the male. The male scrotum, testis, corpus gland, penis, skin glands are given. In the female these reproductive organs are labia majora, ovary, Bertholin glands, clitoris, prostate gland is given. So your shared function is clitoris. So the answer for this question is option D. Question number 21. The changes that occur in female at the onset of puberty are the enlargement of breast the beginning of the menstrual cycle and the stoppage of growth of long bone and height are the changes that occurs in females at onset of puberty and these are called as secondary sexual characters. So the answer is option D. All the changes that are taken place during puberty. So the answer is option D. Question number 22. Amino synthesis is used for determining Amniocentesis is a test done to determine the sex of the fetus and disorder. It is based on chromosomal patterns in the amniotic fluid surrounding the embryo. It is legally banned for the determination of sex as but it is used to kill the normal female fetus. So the answer is option C. Amniocentesis is used to determine hereditary diseases of embryo. Question number 23. Select the correct statement. Barrier method of contraception. This method prevents the ovum and the sperms from physically meeting. Such methods are available for both males and females. For example, condoms. These are made up of thin rubber or latex sheath that covers the penis in the male or vagina and cervix in females. Just before coitus so that the semen may not be ejaculated into the female reproductive tract. Neroth is one of the popular bland. 
sorry niroti is one of the popular brand diaphragm cervical caps and valves these are made up of rubber that is inserted into female reproductive tract to cover the cervix during coitus so the answer is option b cervical caps and valves both are barrier methods of contraception this is a correct statement question number 24 the frequencies of alleles capital a and small a in a population at hardy weinberg equilibrium are 0.7 and 0.3 respectively in a random sample of 250 individuals taken from the population how many are expected to be heterozygous the hardy weinberg equation is the mathematical equation that can be used to calculate the genetic variation of population at equilibrium the equation is an the expression of the principle known as hardy weinberg equilibrium which states that the amount of genetic variation in a population will remain constant from one generation to the next in the absence of disturbing factors so the answer is option c 105 question number 25 during an autoimmune disorder in higher vertebrates the ability to differentiate foreign organisms like pathogens from self cells is observed and this is the basis of an immune response sometimes due to genetic and other unknown reasons the body attacks self cells this results in damage to body and it is called autoimmune disease rheumatoid arthritis which affect many people in our society is an autoimmune disease so the answer is option d both b and c the immune system loses the ability to differentiate between foreign antigens from self antigens the immune system attacks self cells, cells and cause damage to them so both are correct about autoimmune disorder question number 26 how many of the following are diseases that can be caused by bacteria here diseases caused by bacteria typhoid pneumonia malaria amoeba is caused uh, that is you know protozoan disease example amoebiasis askelminthetic disease is ascariasis askelminthetic another disease is filariasis common cold caused by virus so the answer is option d typhoid caused by bacteria and pneumonia also caused by bacteria from the given diseases typhoid and pneumonia are caused by bacteria so the answer is option d only two question number 27 here uh, four statements are given read the following statements about cancer identify true and false ones and select the correct option from the given statements statement a cancer cells lose the property of contact inhibition that is true the property of metastasis is mostly found in benign tumors that is false c the transformation of normal cells into cancerous cells occurs only because of chemical agents that also false statement see the statement d the chemical carcinogen present in tobacco smoke is major cause of lung cancer that is true so the answer is option a from the given four statements statement a and d true b and c are false question number 28 bees are known to play an important role in pollination which of the following implemented to increase pollination efficiency in crop field keeping bee hives in crop field during flowering season is one of the the efficiency to promote pollination in the crop field so the answer is option a bees are pollinators of many crop species such as sunflower brassica apple and pear keeping bee hives in crop field during the flowering period increases pollination efficiency and improves the yield beneficial both from the point of view of crop field and honey yield question number 29 read the following statements regarding agarose gel electroporosis and select the correct one from the given statements statement 1 the longest dna fragment is nearest to the anode is given here the dna fragments can be separated by a technique known as electroporosis where the molecules having a net negative charge migrate towards positive electrode that is service called as anode whereas net positively charged molecules migrate towards negative electrode this is called as cathode 
the negatively charged dna fragments are can be separated by forcing them to move towards the anode under an electric field through a medium agarose a natural polymer extracted from seaweed thus larger fragments move slowly when compared with smaller ones and they tend to remain nearer to the cathode the dna fragments separate according to their size throughout the sieving effect provided by an agarose gel the smallest fragment in size moves the farthest the process is used to check the progression of uh, restriction enzyme digestion so the answer is option c from the given four statements agarose gel electroporosis at correct ones are second third and fourth question number 30 the salt concentration is 30 to 35 in parts per thousand in the salt concentration measured as salinity in parts per thousand is less than 5 in inland water 30 to 35 percent in sea and more than 100 in some hypersaline lagoons so the answer is option b c question number 31 the variation in potency and concentration of uh, Reserpine of Rolfia is an example of genetic diversity is the number and the types of genes as well as chromosomes present in the different species and the variations in the genes and their alleles in the same species hence the variation in potency and the concentration of reserpine of Rolfia is a result of genetic diversity so the answer is option A genetic diversity question number 32 the value of z the slope of line that is uh, regression coefficient is for mammals in the tropical forest of different continents alexander von ampold derived the species area relationship and observed that within a region species richness increased with the increasing explored area but only up to a limit the relationship is a straight line described by the equation log s equal to log c plus z log a where s species richness a area z slope of line c equal to y intercept the value of z line in the range of 0.1 to 0.2 regardless of taxonomic group of the region if we analyze the species area relationship among very large areas like entire continents the slope of line will be much steeper that means z values in the range of 0.6 to 1.2 for figuivorous fruit eating birds and mammals in the tropical forest of different continents the slope is to be 1.15 so the answer is option c 1.15 question number 33 which size of particulate matter is considered to be most harmful for human health according to center for pollution control board practical size less that particle size less than 2.5 microns or less are more harmful human health as they are easily inhaled and result in various respiratory diseases the answer is option c 2.5 mm or less than 2.5 mm particulate matter is considered to be most harmful for human health Question number thirty-four: The correct arrangement of events in the cardiac cycle according to their duration is. See the options. The cardiac cycle includes systole and diastole in a cyclic manner. It includes joint diastole, ventricular systole, and atrial systole. Duration of the total cardiac cycle is point eight second. The duration are atrial diastole last point seven second. ventricular diastole 0.5 seconds ventricular diastole 0.3 second and ventricular systole 0.3 and atrial systole is 0.1 second so the correct order is option a from zoology section a followed by section b from section b we are going to discuss uh, 15 questions question number 1 round worms are different from platyhelminthes in which of the following features Platy helminthes have an incomplete digestive system but the digestive system is complete in ask helminthes or round worms so the answer is option b round worms have complete digestive system 
क्वेश्चन नंबर टू विच आर दी फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट इज करेक्ट अबउट काक्रोच इन काक्रोच बोथ मेल्स एंड फीमेल्स हैव टेन अबडामल सेगमेंट्स इन फीमेल्स द जेनिटल पाउच इज मेड अप ऑफ सेवन एथ एंड नाइन्थ अबडामल स्टेरना आउट ऑफ दिस सेवंथ स्टेरनम इज बोर्ड शेप्ड इन मेल काक्रोचेस द जेनिटल पाउच इज बाउंड बाय द नाइन्थ अबडामल स्टेरनम ऑन द वेंट्रल साइड एंड नाइन्थ एंड टेंथ टेरगा ऑन द डॉसल साइड सो द आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री Read the following statements. Identify the true and the false statements. Statement one: All the carbon compounds that we get from living tissues can be called as biomolecules. Yes, it is true. The second statement: The ash formed after burning a tissue contains inorganic and organic substances. That is false. Statement three: Beta amino acids are used by the cells to form proteins. That also false. From the given three statements. statement 1 alone true so the correct option is b question number 4 tubulin protein is synthesized in which phase of cell cycle tubulin protein is synthesized during interphase of cell cycle interphase is portion of cell cycle that is not accompanied by absorbable changes under the microscope and includes the g1 s and g2 phase so the answer is option c Question number five. Select the statement that is correct related to movement of diaphragm and intercostal muscles for the process of effortless exhalation. The process of effortless exhalation is a passive process which involves relaxation of diaphragm and external intercostal muscles. The answer is option A. Diaphragm relax and external intercostal muscles relax. Question number six. Which organ is responsible for the secretion of the erythropoietin hormone? Erythropoietin is a peptide hormone produced by juxtaglomerular cells in the kidney. So the answer is option B, kidney. It stimulates the formation of RBC. It is commonly called as erythropoiesis. Spleen is known as graveyard for RBC. Question number seven. The antrum is. Antrum is a fluid-filled cavity of graphene follicle. The antrum is fluid-filled space found in the antral or graphene follicle. It is also called as follicular cavity. It is also called liquor follicle. This fluid rich in the hyaluronic acid, hyaluronic acid, and it is used in a modified intracytoplasmic sperm injection. So the answer is option A. fluid filled cavity of graphene follicle question number 8 which of the following organism invaded in the land first the first organism that invaded land were plants about 350 million years ago the origin of jawless fishes fishes that have stout and strong fins could move on land and again go back to the water later on amphibians evolved into reptiles that lay thick shelled eggs that were resistant to dryness in the next 200 million years reptiles developed different shapes and sizes and dominated on earth so the answer is option a plants are the organisms invaded the land first question number 9 which of the following option about various types of antibodies is correct there are five types of antibodies such as uh, immunoglobulin gamma immunoglobulin alpha immunoglobulin muta immunoglobulin delta and immunoglobulin epsilon immunoglobulin gamma is the most abundant antibody forming that is 80 percentage of total antibodies produced by igg it is the only antibody that can pass through the placenta it is formed in the secondary immune response so the answer is option b the most abundant antibody is igg and the antibody which is the largest in size is igm question number 10 identify the correct answer with respect to rna interference here there are two statements are given it is an event of post transcriptional gene silencing is given statement b is it works through rna induced silencing complex both the statements are correctly given in order respect to rna interference 
So the answer is option C, both A and B. Question number 11. Among the following types of soil in increasing order based on the size of mineral particles in them. See the statements. The particle size of clay is 0.002 mm while that silt is 0 0.0022 to 0 0.05 mm. The particle size of fine sand is 0 0.05 to 0 0.2 mm while that of coarse sand is 0 0.2 to 2 mm. So the answer for this question is option B. The soil in the increasing order clay, silt and fine sand that is the correct option. Question number 12. Select the false statement. Some interesting aspects about earth biodiversity are animal species is uh, greater than 70 percent. Plant species including algae, fungi, bryopies, gymnosperms and angiosperms 22 percent. Other species include prokaryotic and protist species lesser than 8 percent. So the answer for this question is option B. Prokaryotic species are more in number in comparison to animal species is given that is a false statement. Question number 13. What gets removed during the processing of pro-insulin to insulin? During the conversion of pro-insulin to insulin, C-peptide is removed from pro-insulin. In mammals including humans, insulin is synthesized as a pro-hormone like a pro-enzyme. The pro-hormone also needs to be processed before it becomes a fully matured and functional hormone which contains an extra stage called C-peptide. The C-peptide is not present in mature insulin. So it is removed during maturation into active insulin. So the answer is option B. Question number 14. Microtubules from opposite poles of spindle get attached to the kinetochore of sister chromatids during. The two cells produced from meiosis 1 will enter into meiosis 2 in which each of the cells has two chromatids. In metaphase 2, the centromere of individual chromosome is attached to the two kinetochore microtubules from either side and chromosomes are arranged in the center. In anaphase 2, splitting up centromere of each chromosome and in propase 2, nuclear membranes disappear along with that chromosome become compact. So the answer is option B. Microtubules from opposite poles of spindle get attached to kinetochore of sister chromatids during metaphase 2. Question number 15. Match the following. See the column A and the column B. Catalytic converter. Catalytic converter carbon dioxide and nitrogen oxide. So you are all know the electrostatic precipitator. It is the most widely used way to remove particulate matter. It can remove over 99% particulate matter from the exhaust of thermal power plant. Scrubber. It can remove gases like sulfur dioxide. So A is matching with carbon dioxide and nitrogen oxide. Electrostatic precipitator is B is matching with particulate matter. C. EMF is uh, matching with fourth one high noise level landfills it is matching with solid waste so the correctly matching option is a thank you for listening our videos those are watching our videos you are requested to like subscribe and share to your friends all the best